Hi, and welcome to this new video about digital painting with Krita. In this case, I want to share with you my ideas about the new proposal that I'm making to the Krita team. So in this proposal, I'm talking about how to make a brush texture docker that we can place in the user interface and to play with uh, all the parameters that we are very used to uh, when we are painting with uh, textural effects or when we are painting with brushes that uses the pattern feature. I think it's a good idea to have this kind of docker because it makes uh, the creative process more fluid uh, for the artist and I think it can multiply the, the range of the possibilities for brushes and as we all love good brushes I think it's, it's a good idea for the creativity artwork so let me show you with a couple of brush strokes what I'm talking about are you ready? let's go we all love good brushes and textural brushes are really useful and Krita has very good features with textural effects. So I'm gonna use this brush. I have something like this. And as you can see here, there is a structure inside which is produced by the pattern. Okay, so if I increase the size of the brush, which, I'm, which I can do here, or just with the shift and drag, I can change the area that is affected by the pattern, this, the, the brush stroke. Okay, by the size of these little areas is always the same. So size doesn't affect the textural structure. So to do that, we have to decrease the scale and then suddenly we have this kind of nice behavior because we are altering easily the structure of the brush stroke and creating even more detail in a very very fast way. The good thing is that we can alter a lot of things. We can go to the multiply and play with brightness and contrast. So we have really good features already here. Okay? But when we are in a creative mode and now I want to resize the pattern size to create a new, a new structure I have to go to the brush editor and then go to the scale and then go outside the brush editor and just paint these are three clicks for um, one task that can be done just with a simple slider okay so my idea is to have a little docker here just to play with the scale and brightness and contrast and the invert feature because this allows us to create very fast really interesting effects because we can control how this behaves with the new uh, parameters. I think this can add a lot of interest for, for digital painters to have uh, this kind of, of docker and minimal docker. So in my proposal I have made um, this is the proposal that I've done and you can see here this is the, the kind of um, docker that I would like to have. I think Docker is a good idea because we can have activated or not activated. Not not everybody are using already um, so much textural effect in in Krita. Maybe because it's uh, hard to to change parameters faster, or maybe because because uh, people doesn't know they have all these beautiful parameters to play with. This is my proposal. I think this video helps uh, everybody to understand what I think is a, is a good feature. If you have uh, ideas, uh, please uh, let me know in the comments. Um, 
or in the task because is this is um, in the task uh, fabricator this is here I put the link on description so you can uh, comment here if you are familiar with uh, fabricator but you can leave comments uh, and I can transfer to the to the developers maybe they get interest because this takes time and time is money so uh, proportion just a, a, a wish feature or wish list or it's a wish list as I am reading here on the screen okay there is one last thing that would like to comment about this proportion we can have an example by using uh, let me check in this case I will test with this one which is a uh, very basic in in the behavior i have uh, some kind of grain and i can alter this by alter the pattern options here the parameters of the brightness affects really how the grain behaves so if i reduce the grain have more uh, i have reduced the brightness re increase the, the grainy effect and we can see a preview here just check it out how this behaves or we can increase the the size of the of the grain so imagine if we have this little docker here we can play a lot with the values or imagine uh, another kind of uh, brush like this and we start to play with the scale here um, and trying to get more effects just playing with these values so my proportional is not only for uh, weird things but uh, common things like uh, varying the the grain of the of the brush stroke or varying the brightness and contrast um, in usual brushes which produces a wide range of brush strokes and I think this is really interesting and thanks for your hard work with with Krita thanks for watching bye